My name's, uh, my name's uh, Aaron Davidson and I'm a general squatter. Uh, I chose to live in the woods because it's, it's cheaper and it's more natural, you know, it's more down to nature. And I'll show you my crib, come. So yeah, a little bit of history about me is, uh, since I was a young kid, my parents are mad crazy hippies taking me to all sorts of uh, psytrance events, the psychedelic trance, that really introduced me to something different, you know. And uh, they also took me to a load of um, anti-capitalist um, protests, activist events, like that we'd, ha we'd be climbing up big rafters, big aerial towers, protesting against genetically modified foods and crazy stuff like that. Yeah, and then, uh, then I was introduced to the to the, the living squat scene. Now that was something different, you know. We'd be starting up a community centre in, uh, in all sorts of abandoned buildings. Really nice. You'd have like 150 people helping out. We'd have like security teams standing over the front and uh, stuff like that. You know, it's really nice. for the, uh, the anti-capitalist protests, we'll be throwing smoke bombs and just, you know, trying to start, provoke a riot, so that, uh, because, you know, for something like society that's, that's on its way out, it needs to be broke before it can be fixed. So, you know, we see the, the way of really smashing the system is a way of <laughs> helping you guys. <laughs> but other than that, you know, as a uh, silly, reasons like smoking and growing pot but who doesn't at the end of the day you know <laughs> either way you know and, uh, say when I get attacked in places like this I would have to use uh, my Kung Fu special moves I'll show you, I'll show you. Of course, uh, we grow our own food over there. We grow turnips, beetroots, we grow cauliflower, cabbages, Romanesco, broccoli, you name it, everything. We grow peppers. And um, of course, you have these leaves, wonderful foliage around you. This is a salad on, on nature, you know, it's a free salad, just 
ground, you pick off the berries, pick the leaves, put it in a stew pot, boil it up, Jumanji. And yeah, of course, there's also Tesco's, or the odd shoplift, but no, I won't go there, that's not me, that's not me. Um, Tesco's, anyway, uh, skipping around the back of Tesco's, you go around the back, you can, um, sometimes you may have to jump over a brick wall, but either way, the end of every day or the start of every morning, they put all of their produce that has just gone out of date. It's still very good to eat. It's just very good food. You know, they're just going to chuck that in the bin and bury it under a hill in a landfill site somewhere. So yeah, me and uh, me and my buddies, we uh, sometimes go skipping. They call it. We jump in skips. We swim about in the food. We just get sacks and sacks of good food. Then we feed all our homeless friends. And we have a really nice time. We like a campfire and just really nice communal session of food, good music and general good fun. So yeah, I do some busking with uh, instruments. Sometimes we make our own instruments. Make flutes out of bamboo. Those some good. Make, make some cash out of selling those. We busk outside stations and all sorts of places in London. Central London's good. Brick Lane is a good place. Yeah, we do. It's quite local as well. Uh, nice talking to you. I'm Aaron Davidson, the squatter. One love. Ciao!